my Geminis, it's Jamie Zebra 23. I am doing your March 2019 spread for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Cross Watchers. I'm on all social media. It's Jamie Zebra 23. If you'd like a personal reading, you can check out the website, jamiezebra23.com. My readings are 20 minutes, 40 minutes, and 60 minutes. I typically do your readings within 24 to 48 hours. I also have a new feature, same day readings. It's a little pricier, but you do get your readings the same day. I also have an $8 one question, one answer via email only. I typically answer you within about 20 minutes. So be sure to write your email addresses correctly so that I can email you back fairly quickly. I've also got full size candles, do it yourself love kits, protection kits, prosperity kits, crystal stones, pendants, Florida water, Florida water soap, incense sage, protection bracelets, pendulum for, for divination and prophecy, lots more. JamieZebra23.com. Keep in mind that these are general readings. They are not personal readings, so they may or may not resonate. So be sure to check out your sun, your moon, and your rising videos for further insight. This is for Gemini, sun, moon, rising, Venus, and cross watchers, March 2019. Okay. So, Gemini. You guys have a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio that looks like it looks like they're going to come back. They're either going to uh, contact you somehow, email, social media, um, knock on your doorstep, seek you out, ask other people to contact you. But definitely a, um, a return of a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio um, looking like around the 8th of March. But um, for some of you, it could be different. But it's for, for the most part, it looks like Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio is returning the 8th of March, 2019. Um, some of you are going to be really, really shocked about this. Some of you are going to, be, it's going to be bittersweet. So it's kind of like, this is what I wanted to happen, but it's like, now that they're here, oh no, now what do I do? <laughs> Maybe I don't want them after all. I feel like for some of you, the motivation is financial. Somebody's not doing very well financially, or maybe they're going through a breakup, or maybe they're in a third party situation, but now they want to come back in and try to reconcile with you. I do feel like there's a Capricorn, a Taurus, or a Virgo. Um, this person is either immature energy or a young person. I feel like they're causing a lot of strife for this Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio. Um, and that's why they want to return to you where things were easy. Um, I do see that for some of you, you might want to walk away from somebody in the month of uh, March 2019. I feel like there's still emotions there. I feel like you will, if you do walk away from somebody in March 2019, you'll be back. Um, so don't do anything stupid. So like, let's say you break up with someone. You're like, you know what? I think the grass is greener over there. Don't tell them about how many people you're having sex with and that you started a new relationship because come the end of retrograde. No, no, please don't do that. Come the end of retrograde, you're going to want to go back there and how are you, you know, maybe somebody might not want you back if they found out you, you know, did it with a lot of people or even with one person. You know, they're like, ew, uh, this changes, this is a game changer. So instead of wrecking something that's a decent relationship already, Let's not. Okay. Also, Gemini, you must watch your temper and watch your words in the month of March 2019. You have to. Um, even if you don't think you're saying anything wrong, watch your words. You know, go through it in your head before you say it. Think before you say it because it could cost you your job. So make sure if, you know, you've got something directed towards a coworker or a supervisor, please don't do that. Um, I've got children. If that's upsetting, you can click off. It's sad that I have to tell people that. People are like, we don't mind your kids. No, this is not for those of you that don't mind my kids. This is for the people that email me and tell me, you know, to go drown my children. That's who this message is for. So if you don't, if this, you can't handle this, click off now. Click off now and don't come back. All right. So um, watch, watch your anger when it comes to um, at work. Also watch your anger. Like let's say you know, you live in an apartment complex. You might not want to go in there and threaten the, um, the manager. You might get evicted. So just watch what you're doing because it could lead to homelessness or financial strife. So behave yourselves. You know, it's retrograde. This energy doesn't feel good. I mean, a lot of times, you know, Gemini, you guys are going through a retro. It's like an, a constant retrograde energy for you guys because you guys are Geminis, the twins, the switching sides. So just, um, just try to lay low. That's the best advice I can give you. For March 2019, lay low during the retrograde. You know, go to work, live your life, but just don't don't start any drama. If somebody tries to start drama with you, wait till after retrograde to handle it. Um, I do see that for some of you, you're going to need a lawyer for something. Um, there may be an accident or something. It looks like everybody lives and everybody's fine, but it looks like you get money out of it. So maybe a little fender bender. Of course, you know, this is not for everybody, so I don't need people emailing me, freaking out, saying, is it me, is it me? Just stay calm and drive safe. 
It'll be fine. Okay, um, I do see that new romantic uh, energy is coming in with a Capricorn, a Taurus, or a Virgo. Please be open to new love because it shows here that this, whoever this is, you might be um, kind of jaded from a past situation or from a current situation that you won't be open to this new love. Try to do it. Also, for some of you, you have a Capricorn, a Taurus, or a Virgo person that you've been on and off again. That's possibly a criminal. This person could be going to jail soon. So just make sure that they don't have access to your credit cards or access to the credit cards to the people that you love or care for because who wants, you know, their mom or dad being robbed. So just, yeah. So just try to keep it together. You got good news coming. As far as finances go, if you plan ahead and you're and you stay prepared, it looks like it'll be you'll get through, but you may have to ask for assistance this month of um of March 2019. All right guys, jamiezebra23.com. Ta-ta for now.